Guys, in this video, what I wanted to do is to take a few minutes to do kind of an unboxing video. Uh, this is some stuff that my friends over at 1791 Gun Leather sent out to me. Full disclosure, guys, they did send me this stuff. And I just wanted to take a few minutes to show it to you all in a video as well as to say thank you to them for sending it out. And I will put a link down below this video to where you guys can go down and check out some of their stuff. If you have been a follower of my channel for a while, you'll know that I like their stuff. And they are a very good company. You know, there again, they make quality stuff. That's the thing. In this day and age, you want to make sure that whatever you get is quality. And that's what we have here. Okay? First thing, they sent me a hat. It's got their logo on it, and you can get these off of their website, and these are very nice hats. Uh, I'm sure my son's probably going to end up stealing this from me. He always steals all of my hats. Very nice. I really like that. Very good hat. They also sent these. Okay. A little bit of swag, I guess you could say. Let's go ahead and get into these. Open these up. Take a look at them. Stickers. Okay, just all kinds of stickers. Very cool. This belt and this holster. This belt is one that is very, very well made. Let's go ahead and get this out of the plastic. You know, if you've been a follower of my channel, I have talked about having a good gun belt. And that's what we have here. You look at the thickness of this. Very well made. I've got this in the antique finish. Okay, this is the finish that I like, and you can see there's their logo right there. They do have different styles and stuff, uh, you know, that you can get several different colors, things like that. The antique is what I really like, that's just kind of what I kind of matches what I do and we have a holster this holster is for a Glock 19 or I, you know it will fit others it will fit other makes and models just to kind of show you some of the ones right here that it will fit okay let's get into it let's go ahead and get this open because I want to show you something about these holsters of course, you got your instructions on break in. Go up, check out the video that I did on how to break these in. I will put a card to that video up in the corner. Uh, go check that out if you want to know how to break in one of their holsters. What I wanted to do is show you a comparison of this belt and this holster. And yeah, I know I'm not facing the right direction. Look at the width of the holster, the loops through this belt. Okay, right now, this is very stiff because it is new. Okay, I'm just going to start it through this side here. Okay, we just got it started. This, as you can see, is a very snug fit as it should be because what you do not want to happen is you do not want that holster to rock okay if you had like a real skinny belt a real thin belt it's not going to keep that holster stable but you can kind of see here i'm just going to hold with my hand just this tip and then i'm going to rock and you can see that there is not any movement hardly at all on that okay and yes, this is stiff. Okay, if you get one of these, uh, I've seen people complain about these being stiff. They're supposed to be. Okay, they're supposed to be just a little bit stiff. Okay, now they will wear in, they will break in. It is leather. Now you can see here, just to show you the edges, that's how you can always tell good leather work, is to check the edges. The edges on this holster are very smooth, very clean. We've got the stitching. You can see the stitching through here. 
how well it is around the molding. You can see that we're double stitched here. The stitching is going to be the life of your holster. Okay, if your stitching is not solid, the holster is not going to hold up. But you can see here, these are very well stitched. You've got the stiffening panel here. It's blended perfectly. Very solid. Very nice. I love that finish. Now, I have my Glock 19 here. For the YouTube folks, we're unloaded, we're clear, we're safe. This is going to be tight. Okay? It's always a little bit snug on a new holster. There again, go over and check out my video. This is is made as we saw for a Glock 19 but it is very tight okay okay guys I took a minute and got the pistol worked into the holster and as I'd mentioned these are going to be tight when you first get them okay and this is basically just going to be the initial stretch for this holster for me I'm going to leave the gun in here for a few days, just let it set, the leather will stretch out, then I'm going to take it out, wrap it in a plastic bag, push it back in there just like I did in the video on how to break one of these in. Okay, you can see how the gun sets, just to show you. Now, I want you to pay attention to something, I brought this up before in other videos. You can see the trigger is completely covered. Some folks will talk about the fact that there's just a little bit of a gap here. Okay, that trigger's covered. There is nothing going to get against that trigger. Okay, you can see here, look at it this way. You know, it is covered, both sides. Okay, the reason you don't want that up too high is you need to be able to get a grip on that firearm. I want you to look at my hand. Okay, I have room for you know as big as my hands are I have room to get a grip on this firearm and that's what you want you want to be able to get that grip on that firearm and 1791 gun leather has got this cut at just the right angle okay you can get that grip in there my fingers are right up against that trigger guard okay they're right up against there that's where I want it to be okay go watch my videos on making sure that you get a proper grip on a firearm okay that's what you want right there okay very nice very very nice setup there very solid holster I love their stuff big fan thanks again guys over there you can see the stitching here their logo very nice and I love that finish but guys, I will put a link to 1791 Gun Leather down in the description below. Go over there, tell them that I said thank you for sending this out to me. I appreciate it. And guys, I have been buying their stuff for years, uh, well before uh, they had sent me anything. You know, before I was an affiliate. I really like their stuff. I think that it is quality. Okay. I love a good leather holster. And that's what we have here absolutely beautiful guys thanks for watching check out the rest of the videos on my channel check out the links down in the description let me hear from you and we'll see you next time